Stamp Cell Pioneer, Haruko Obokata. Haruko Obokata, 30, is a tenacious researcher with a never-give-up attitude. She is also a new star in the science world. But it wasn't always that way, she says. There were many days when I wanted to give up on my research and cried all night long. She said this at a news conference on January 28th at Riken Center for Developmental Biology in Kobe, Japan. But I encouraged myself to hold on for just one more day, and then I realized that five years had passed, she added. Dr. Obokata led a research team who discovered a new method to create pluripotent stem cells in mice. The new method is called Stimulus Triggered Acquisition of Pluripotency, or STAP for short. They're called STAP cells. The discovery is a major breakthrough in regenerative medicine because STAP cells are more easily created than iPS-induced pluripotent stem cells, and gene damage is minimal compared to embryonic stem cells. Stem cells are used to grow all kinds of other cells for repair of body tissue. Dr. Obokata achieved this breakthrough just three years after she earned her Ph.D. Her academic journey began in 2002 when she entered Waseda University's Faculty of Engineering and Science. In her interview, she said she wanted to incorporate a chemistry-based approach into the field of regenerative medicine. In graduate school, she studied at Tokyo Women's Medical University and also studied for half a year at Harvard University where she came up with ideas that would lead to the discovery of STAP cells. Her strengths are her chemistry background and the fact that she has no preconce preconceived ideas about biology. She backs up her work and results with data. She works 12 hours a day at her laboratory where she keeps a pet turtle. She enjoys shopping on her days off. She said she thinks about her research all day long, even when taking a bath or when she's on a date with her boyfriend. She is a true inspiration for young women in Japan.